Heather. Don't look so startled. I've put a spell on you without you even knowing. Spells don't exist? Oh, sweetie. Aren't you in for a surprise? You're going to come with me, my dear? No. <laughs> You really had no idea, didn't you? I told you that spells exist. Now, I'm taking you to my home. Alright then, cutie. Sit yourself down in the chair right there. Aren't you a good one? You didn't even try resisting. I mean, clearly you can't. As you're still under my spell. <laughs> Give me your hands. Good. Let me tie them up. There you go. Now I'm to release you from the spell. Well. Well, easy there, darling. You need to calm down. I don't want you getting too excited. I know things might be a bit confusing since I just released you from being under my spell and all that. But I have to do it in order to get you here. Now, do you believe in my spell? Good for you to not be upset at a witch. And to not upset a witch. Yes, I am a witch. I thought that would be fairly obvious at this point. Yes, I am great with spells. I wouldn't have been able to cast this spell on you without my knowledge and skills and expertise. It may be a second nature to me by now. I wasn't always this amazing with casting spells. I literally had to learn all this so I could have you all to myself. Oh, silly. You really think you're going to leave? you asked for it. What did I just do? Well, I just casted another spell that made the restraints tighter. I can't have you struggling at, at all, sweetie. Oh, you poor thing. You look so scared right now. Don't you worry one bit. It's all going to be fine. I'm going to take great care of you. You'll be able to have anything you want. You're free to? <laughs> not gonna happen. You need to be good for me and not resist my love before I give you more freedom. One day you'll be given more privileges, but for now, you have to sit there. And bother trying to resist since you can't really move with how tight the restraints are. They feel uncomfortable? Oh, <laughs> you poor thing. I'm afraid that's what you get though for being so naughty and resisting. I'll loosen them a bit soon. But for now, you have to deal with it. prevent that. And even if you do sustain some injuries, well, I can just use some other spells to heal you. Oh yeah, of course. 
Not all of the spells I know are nefarious. I can heal injuries too. <laughs> You're asking why would I do bad things with my spells? What bad things did I do? Kidnapping? Oh, maybe that's a bad thing. Would you have gone with a witch like me if I asked you nicely? That's what I thought, dear. I'd recommend being nice to me, otherwise I'll use spells that he will give you some discomfort. You would want that, would you? Good. I don't want that either. I don't want you to have to be even more already are. I know the restraints are a bit uncomfortable for you right now. I'll remove the spell when you calm yourself down a bit. I can't have you misbehaving and acting like you don't want to accept my love. It hurts when you disrespect me like that. All that I'm going to do is take care of you and love you, darling. I don't understand how you could be so cruel. I'm the one being cruel? That's silly. I take you to a new home and promise to take care of everything for you forever. And you think I'm being cruel? You ungrateful little... Whatever. so cruel and get with the program. You're with me forever and you better accept that love. <laughs> there you go again being silly. Maybe I should use a spell that seals your mouth shut so you can't speak since all that you're saying is a bunch of awful things. That's better. You're really going to keep saying that stuff, aren't you? Just like that. You really are testing the hell out of my patience, darling. Oh, lordy lord. You need to behave yourself. Or I'm going to punish you even more. Of you being naughty, I'm gonna cast a spell to seal your mouth shut now. Oh, <laughs> now you're begging. That's adorable. But no, this is what you get for being so rude to me. You're my partner now. I can have you being this rude. It hurts me when I've shown you so much love and devotion for you. And in return, I can't disrespect it. I'll unseal your mouth in a little while. But for now, it's gonna be shut tightly by my spells. That's better. Now, you're good and quiet for me. No. Oh. Be for that long. Next thing you know it, you'll be able to speak again. I'm hoping by then you'll be more mature and respectful towards your new lover. Oh, 
Silly, you can't speak. Don't bother trying. You can't open your mouth because of my spell. You can still breathe, though, through your nose, obviously. I don't want you to suffocate. But you're not going to be able to speak. I'll be back in a little while. I want you to have a good think about loving me back. Okay, dear? See you later. I love you. If you enjoyed the video, please leave a comment and watch another video. If you'd like to donate, I have my coffee linked below and my Patreon for early access videos and exclusive audios for the higher tiers. And come check out the Discord. Noblesse oblige. Thank you for your continuing service as my subscriber.